what is going on with this game <laughs> what's going on guys um, I'm a new commentator so thank you if you're here first thing and this is a brand new game whoa this updates insane so so many new things we have all the graphics that have changed the arena has changed there's been buffs to some of the troops and yeah like wow what do you guys think so many things going on um, first I want to apologize for that gunshine logo you guys see at the top of the screen there um, yeah, I can't really do anything about that for right now. There's a watermark that normally is placed there by the recording device I'm using. Um, basically on all their videos they tag them, because I only have a demo version. I haven't downloaded the full version yet. I will get it eventually. Um, but yeah, I'm not, I'm not blowing money on that if I don't end up using it. Gotta try it out first, right? So 30 days from now? Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably use something else. You're not gonna have to worry about that when it's a different game because for ava which is alliance of valiant arms which is a great game you guys should really check that out i'm gonna leave a link for that it's a first person shooter that's a free game so you can you know just download it onto your browser or onto your desktop play it whenever you can add me there play it together it's fucking cool you'll love it um maybe wait till i put up a video of it and then you can see what it's kind of like or just do a Google search, and I'm sure you'll find 100 other people playing it. Now, right now in the background, we just have a bunch of uh, talent rolls going on. See, I just picked up the Duke there. I have one on my main, but this is one for a Smurf. So I'm going to be... I gave this to one of my friends in the uh, the New World chat. Y, Y-T-Y? Y-F-Y? So we're kind of sharing the account, and we're building it up. It's kind of fun. It's kind of cool, cool experience to build an account with somebody else. One that isn't just yours. Um... Yeah, I'm not worried if he took the whole thing because, you know, it's not much on it. I'm going to spend a bit of time with it. Ooh, gelatinous slime. Don't you hate those? You think you're going to get another legendary? One that would go on my Thunder God account too? It would have been nice. I would have liked that gift. But no, no Reaper for me. Not on these rolls. Come on, maybe one. <laughs> we'll see. Um, yeah, what was I just talking about? Dang, it's hard to stay on topic here. Yeah, the graphics though. Um, there's some good and there's some bad with it, in my opinion. The walls look fine. I'm fine with that. The whole cartooniness to it, you know, it's a little off with everything. It's going to take getting used to, especially the new interface when the new ways you click around everywhere. The lock heroes doesn't work, so that needs to be updated. There's quite a few little things they need to patch, so there should be a good update coming soon, hopefully, just to kind of make everything run a little bit smoother. Um, but one of the, th yeah, like the towers also, that orange color awful there's a couple good ones though there's a couple you can't complain about and uh one of them's the assassin i know when you guys see her like she she definitely got a boob job eh she looks she looks fly <laughs> she looks great succubus looks a little bit weird but she's still good the girls are still good in this game um succubus though yeah well, let's get on that a bit because we're talking about the arena too like the arena has changed a lot the arena is my, my new favorite place. Like before, I was sitting around in maybe 700, somewhere around there, up to like 3,000 occasionally. I try and stay, try and stay below 1,000, because you always want to pick up that 100, 100 HP. Um, but I drop below most of the time when I'm inactive, like when I go to sleep. But during the day, I can always stay within that 100, and that's what I've been aiming for. So it hasn't been too hard sticking that. But with this update, oh my God, it's. It's just the greatest gift IGG could have given me in a way, because it's so much fun to just go through the ranks again. Like, I'm I'm right up at uh, 424 right now, waiting on a couple more chances to go even lower. I haven't been stopped. Either every attempt or second attempt, I've been moving up. I haven't gone down at all. People have been attacking me on this way down, but it's been flawless. So if I can make it to the top 300, I'll be really happy. That's pretty good for a free-to-play player. And it's because of this girl right here that's consuming all these... Uh, gelatinous slime right now oh she's halfway to four of nine i'm gonna get that tomorrow i'm really looking forward to it um succubus though she destroys in the arena now it's insane so going in there first round up set my heroes up and succubus gets to that shrine she's whipping away she's whipping away and then she procs and when she procs she lands over a hundred k damage like are you kidding me is that even plausible? That What? Who would have thought that Succubus would be the arena star? This has got to really hurt pay-to-play players in a way. Because now like some of the top K 
contenders in the arena aren't even the ones that they uh the spirit mage that they paid for like dps setups are kind of the way you need to go now i mean not unless you're going to get a head-on collision but the other thing is like paladins are really good too like they destroy in the arena too because they just well they don't destroy necessarily they build up you know they really they give hp to your shrine it's awesome i'm i'm sticking with my paladin for now i was gonna just leave him i was planning on getting the reaper with 700 shards it's gonna save up for that bad boy but now with the arena progress i've been making it's like damn let's roll his talents let's get his let's get his skill up and let's level that bastard because he is just oh he's winning battles for me you send him against their other team in a lane and then you send your dps the other way and you know you win every time Ooh, look at that thunder god look at that four or five heavy blow that's gonna be real nice boss battles i have one guy that i battle it against every time for second place and uh this might have just clutched me that that is awesome four slash five pumpkin duke three slash five berserk really that is my favorite talent berserk on pumpkin duke destroys and raids now with the longer time in arena it's going to be really good i don't need to waste any gems re-rolling for revitalize on him right now which you know would be better if he had a five five or you know three five i guess it would be more powerful but he's gonna be at that shrine doing 25 percent faster with his boost of 25 percent soon to be 30 that's the thing i'm gonna be getting up after succubus it's gonna be him then succubus him then succubus gonna go back and forth leveling up those two should be real nice it's really open i get reaper on that one roll only had one roll to do with her ah oh well more food for succubus she'll get up there she's doing good oh well that's the end of the video so i guess there's a couple of other things i want to talk about but it's over um so catch you guys later in the next one cheers bye